I want to show you something that's really strange. So um, let's let's look at this here. Find the equation of the line that passes through this point and this point here. So normally we we would draw a, a quick graph. Um, so so this point here is uh, is this point here. Okay. So so this is our graph here, uh, and uh, and this point here is uh, is this point here. Okay. Um, so so we, we've got to find out the equation of the line that passes through those two points, which is this one here. Okay. Um, well, uh, the minute you see a uh, the minute you see a straight line, you you've got to write this down. Y equals m x plus c. Now to find out the um, the the, uh, the gradient, the, the to find out the gradient here, you you would need to work out this height here. Okay. Uh, you see th this height is really easy to find once you once you've drawn the uh, the graph. So here up well. The, the the up and down here, well, this this distance from here to here is four, and then and then from here to here is three. So so the 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 overall height, hang on, the overall height would be would be uh, seven. Okay, so so basically you you would look at this and then you would look at this and then you can see it's seven. And uh, and uh, the uh, the across here, if you like, the uh, uh, the width here. Well, the width here. Well, look, you you would then look at this. And this number here. Well, from here to here is it, it's uh, nine, and then from here to here it's uh, seven. So, so, so the 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 width, the whole, the total width here is uh, is sixteen. Okay. So, so this here is sixteen, and this here is seven. Okay. And and then so so the gradient is basically the uh, the height divided by the uh, the width, and uh, and it's a positive gradient, so you don't need to stick a negative sign in there. So, so, so the gradient here is seven over sixteen. Okay, hang on, let, let, let me just write that down here. So, so the gradient of this is um, is uh, seven seven over sixteen. Okay. Now, here's a weird thing. Um, you here's a quick way of doing it. You see, when you're given two points, this point here and this point here. Um, you can just get one point, let's say this one here, take away this point and, and, and it will give you the gradient. So, so for example, hand, you see what I mean? Hand. Let's say you want to know the height here. Okay. Well, the height here, you're interested in, in the y coordinates of, of the two points. So, so the y here, if you look at this, this is the y here. Because, hang on, remember that this point here, this is the x and this is the y. Okay, this is the x, and uh, this point here is, uh, is the y. Okay, now because you're interested in the height of this thing, you're interested in, in the y, the y side of it. So this is a y, this is the y. Now, the, here's a weird thing if you just get this, take away this, okay, it will give you the height. So, so for example, 4, because you, you, you've got this here, but basically, just get this point, take away this point. And and it works the other way around as well. Uh, you you could get this point, take away this point. Everything adds up. You will see why later on. Hang on. Uh, so so now we want another height. So uh, we just get this point four, which is here. Take away uh, take away this point here, which happens to be minus three. So so put put minus three in there. Okay. So that that's your that's that's a height. Okay. Then we've got to divide it by. Um, Divided by this length here. The weird thing is this length here. Well, this length here. You're interested in the x side of things, the the acrossness. The, well, the, well, the, well. You're you you're interested in this nine and this uh this this bit here, the minus seven. So because we are getting this point, taking away this point here. Let's get nine. Take away, take away, uh, take away this this here, which is minus seven. Which is minus seven. Okay, so 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 now, well, we are getting the the height. The top part represents the height, and then we we're dividing it by the cross. So we're dividing it. So so this here is our m. Okay, now now m here equals. Hang on. So m here equals well four minus minus three. So let's 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 let imagine you putting your fingers in here and taking a three out. And turn it into a plus. So in effect, it's it's four plus three. It's the same thing. Now you've got a minus and a minus. So imagine you putting your your fingers into the bubble here. Take take the minus three out. 
uh, sorry, take the minus out, and then uh, and then while well, minus and a minus, that's like adding. Okay, so so basically this thing here is seven, um, and then this thing here would be uh, would be not uh, would be sixteen. Nine plus seven is sixteen. You see this this method here matches up with with our earlier method. Okay, so so when 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 you're given two points. When you're given two points here, you, you could draw the whole diagram and then, and then somehow figure out this and then figure out this. But my, but in this video, what I'm trying to say is that you can just get one, you can just get one point, take away the other point. Here, we, well, you, you can just get this point here, take away this point here, and that will give you the gradient. So for example, earlier, we, we, we took this point, take away this point. Now, I'm going to take, I'm going to get this point, Take away this point, and, and it it will still give us the gradient. Okay, so so you you don't need to draw anything. So so watch watch this here. Okay, I'm I'm going to get this point. Take away this point, but um, in order to work out the gradient, I need the 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 height here, the up and down. Well, the up and down, you're interested in in the y y here. This is a y here. You're interested in these two numbers. Okay, now because because I chose uh, to get this, take away this. Okay, so I'm going to have to get the the y side take away the the y side of this. So basically, I'm saying m equals. Now I'm just going to get this uh, minus three take away four this time, so positive four. So so that's that's the top part. Now I'm I've got to divide it by the 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 acrossness if you want um, the acrossness. So so I'm interested in the the x side of things. So so this is x. So this is x here. This is x here. Well, re remember, I, I'm, I said right from the start, I'm going to get this point, take away this point. So I've got to get minus seven, minus seven, take away, take away uh, the uh, take away. Remember, I've got to get the x, uh, take away the x, the y, take away the y. So I'm, I'm getting the well here. I'm, I'm doing I'm doing the x. So I'm getting x here. Take away this x here. Which is uh, which is nine, okay? So this here, well minus. Hang on, hang on, bear with me. So uh, I I'm going down here, m here. So minus three, minus four. That would be minus seven over minus seven minus uh, minus seven minus nine would be minus sixteen. Minus sixteen. Here, uh, so so two minuses. I know it's a bit weird here, but the thing is, two minuses they, they cancel each other out. So, so they you, you can just imagine it like this, okay? Two minuses they they cancel each other out. Um, uh, okay, so so it's well, so so m really is uh, is seven over sixteen. See, seven over sixteen. This is what we had earlier. It, it, everything's consistent. So my point is, rather than rather than draw. Rather than drawing the whole diagram, you can just get you can just get this, take away this, uh, so so that that will give you the the height, and then and then this, take away this, that will give you uh, that will give you um, the, the the width here, and then and then get this divided by this. So basically, when when you're given two points here, um, if you want to know the gradient, hang on, if you want to know the gradient m, all you have to do is just well remember. You're interested in the y, the y, the y divided by by this. Okay, so let's let's look at the y. The y. You're interested in the y here and the y here. So so just get minus three, take away four, and then now you've got to divide it by. See, divide it by, divide it by this thing here. So that means you're interested in the x side of things. So so x here, x here. So it's minus seven, uh, minus seven, uh, minus minus nine here okay so so work, then work this out that will give you that will give you m or you can get this point take away this point it, it, it will still work so here um well when when you when when you want to know the height well the height the height means you're, you're interested in the y side of things so this here's a y this here's a y so so here well my, my point is that it will still work if, if you do this get this one so four take away and then take away uh, minus three uh, and then and then over now get this point here nine nine uh, take away 
take away negative 7 here, negative 7 here. So, so here, this here is the same as this. My, my, my point is that you, you can, you can get this, take away this, or you can get this, take away this. It doesn't matter. Okay. Um, I, I know it's a bit weird, but, um, I, I will give you some practice in the next video. And then, and then after a while, it will make sense. Okay.